Well, I know you've brought along the uh, Mandela files. You've drawn many cartoons that involve Mandela. Can you show us some of the ones that he's responded to? Yeah, I mean, there's... Um, well, one, one thing that was really nice was that I, when I started putting a book together of the cartoons in, in 96, so it's, a, it's in between when I first met him and when he phoned me, um, I thought maybe I'll get a reaction from him, yeah. a shout for the back of the book. And I was kind of audacious enough to actually ask his personal assistant, Parks Manka Klana, phoned him and said, listen, is it possible? And what do you think? Do you think the old man would actually do that? And he said, yeah, I'm sure, you know, just leave some of the cartoons here and he'll... So I did. A few days later, I phoned up and I said, has he managed it? Said, yes, he's written something. So I went and I got my cartoons and there on a piece of paper it was written, uh, very exciting and uh, quite accurate. <laughs> <laughs> Nelson Mandela. And it, it's so kind of succinct and it's so... It, it was fantastic to get it from him. And when, when I first saw that, I kind of... It, I was also a little taken aback. Well, the word quite for me is, is it's more a little bit like rather, rather, yeah. rather accurate. Or what exactly, but he is, he is quite archaic in his use of language. So quite for me, for him, it means exactly. Exactly accurate. Yeah, exactly yeah. accurate, which is quite a, a, an interesting way to describe cartoons. You know, it really felt like he had reacted to you know, what I was trying to do in the, in the cartoon. It was great. And this one was really funny because, okay, here's this cartoon where... 97, where are we? 97, he's now, he's still, he's still president and he is mediating in the, um, in the, in the peace talks um, for, for Zaire, uh, Zaire becoming the Democratic Republic of Congo. And he's sitting here between Lauren Kabila and the dictator Mobutu Sese Seko. So he says, uh, and I remain confident of a speedy handover to democracy, the protagonists being two of Africa's greatest sons. The journalist says, with respect, President Mandela, how can you possibly describe Mobutu as one of Africa's greatest sons? He says, in his case, the first draft read, one of Africa's greatest kleptomaniac tyrant sons of bitches. <laughs> and then there's a little smile from him and says, diplomacy is in the editor. <laughs> and... You know, I thought it was really, like, quite cheeky yeah. to do that. But, you know, you do. You put words in the mouth of, of, of people. That's what you do as a cartoonist. You, it's the hypotheticals, what they're really thinking or what's behind the scenes or whatever. Anyway, I, a little while later, I get a, a message from someone who says that Arch, Archbishop Tutu, the Arch, had seen the cartoon and loved it yeah. and had actually shown it to Madiba. And apparently the Madiba read it and then the two of them just hooted with laughter. <laughs> And they kind of apparently agreed, you know, that diplomacy is in the editor. <laughs> what so does it feel like oh, to hear geez. that feedback? Uh, you know, that's priceless. It's, uh, it's, it is, it's beyond anything I could have expected as a cartoonist. I mean, coming in as an activist, you know, up against the system, actually being in detention without trial because the security police thought I was on the Mandela Birthday Committee, mm -hmm. uh, organizing for his 70th birthday in 1987 and then actually I wasn't on that committee but I mean so being there and being we I tried to do a birthday card and send that through to him it was intercepted by security police you know so that's where I came from yeah. and come into the new South Africa and find myself actually having contact with this man who's becoming fast becoming the greatest human being on the planet uh, I mean already had this legendary status I, you know, so it's it's amazing to have that to have that that, that chance and to be able to criticize him all the while. Yeah. It's not as if I had to sit back and do Sensor no critical yeah. cartoons of him. 